schooling and learning has been disrupted at Holy Trinity Secondary School in Winterfeld. This as the SGB felt that this action could prompt some response from the Gauteng Department of Education. I am joined now by Lucky Musana, the treasurer of the SGB. Thank you so much for your time, sir. Can you just tell us the purpose of disrupting classes for the learners today? Uh, the purpose, uh, thank you very much, uh, uh, Mr. Stumo. The purpose of disrupting uh, classes and close down the, the, the school is because we, we need, uh, we've been requesting uh, chairs, tables and teachers, but uh, the department, uh, they are not responding to our demands and requests. That, that's the reason why today we are here. We've been engaging with them. We've been sending emails to them. They are not responding to us. They are, com they are not coming on board. They are not meeting us halfway. So we've been saying to them, uh, sending them email that we don't have uh, one of the classes, for example, we did inspection, few of the classes. One of the classes, uh, the, the, our learners, they do have two tables, uh, five chairs, and then there are more than 50 overcrowded. How do you want a, a, a learner to be educated without a table, without a chair? And uh, there is a, a pulling taking place as, uh, at school. The reason is because there are no teachers. We've been requesting teachers because uh, the other teachers when are busy teaching in, in other classes. The other classes remain without teachers. We've been indicating to the department that we please uh, give us teachers. We don't have teachers. And they don't do anything. They are irresponsible. Um, uh, there is a second office just a few uh, meters away from where we are. Uh, those are the, the, the second office doesn't do anything good for us. Um, uh, you, you can spoke about the second manager, uh, Mr. Raymond Klovu. Uh, that, that, that guy is very useless because he can meet our demand, he can respond, always he will tell us that uh, he, he did escalate the matter to the head office. So today we need MEC to come down to commit, not promises. We are sick and tired. We are, enough is enough with empty promises. Our learners, they need to be educated. They need to have teach, uh, furniture, uh, teachers in classes. Uh, so we demand that they give us uh, tables, teachers, and chairs. And then the school will remain closed otherwise if they don't meet our demand. MEC uh, Panyazali Sufi must come to us and address us and commit. We need uh, we need our demands must, must be met today. We don't need uh, promises anymore. We are sick and tired. Can you just tell me about your interactions with the department itself? I heard you say that there has been some correspondence, but uh, a lack of response from their side. Uh, look, um, uh, Mr. Stumo, we do have, uh, you can see several letters here. We've been, we've been sending them emails, emailing them, but uh, we, we don't have response. Uh, we approached the district office last week Friday. We spoke to personal assistants uh, of the director. He promised that the di director will revert us uh, this week, uh, revert back to us this week. He never did so. No acknowledgement of email that he did receive our complaints. He, he we go, gonna act on our uh, our matter. He didn't do anything. So, so they are irresponsible. Those officials, they are irresponsible. All of them, all of them, including the second manager, they are irresponsible. Thank you very much. Well, let me try and find out from the learners how they actually feel about the condition in their classrooms. Uh, can you just tell us, uh, how is your classroom? How many chairs? How many facilities do you have in your classroom? We don't have chairs. There are only 20 chairs, I think, and 10 tables. We don't have chairs. We can't even concentrate because one learner is standing up and then the other, they are, they are sitting. They are sitting down, so we can't concentrate. We don't even hear 
teachers when they teach because they are, dis they are disrupting us, they are busy standing up. Yo, we are tired. Yo. Okay, well, now can you just tell us, Vene, how do you feel about the situation in your classroom? Hey, it is bad because we can't concentrate. It's bad. There you have it. These are some of the sentiments at the learners of Holy Trinity Secondary School in Winterfell. They're actually saying that they did the intervention of the provincial education department to get the basic facilities so that they can concentrate in class.